Now to an update tonight on the Hurricane Irma recovery. It is costing some elderly residents their home still in Polk County. We first showed you last night at 11 what this community is going through. Our Carson Chambers, she went back out there today and now she shows us the support these people are getting while they try to figure out what comes next. Most neighborhoods after Irma had tree limbs piled up everywhere in this apartment complex in Frostproof. They've got these shingles just piled up in the neighborhood. That's because a lot of the roofs were actually ripped off and some people are going to have to find a place to live. You've heard the saying, take it one day at a time. It's got um, cranks and beans in there. At Elkhorn Apartments in Frostproof, where renters are elderly and many disabled. In everyone's meal today, there's going to be a meal that you can just put in the microwave. And Folks are taking it hour by hour, and lunch hour is a Red Cross hot meal. I'm glad they came out. I didn't think they were coming at all. I didn't think anybody was coming. Inside apartment 11. It could buckle right now because there's water. Marcia Forsett packed up what she could. That's where I'm at. I, you know, I'm done crying. <laughs> Almost done crying. Her belongings are going into storage thanks to a friend who volunteered to help, but she doesn't even know where she'll spend the night yet. The care center uh, here in Frostproof is um, going to help me with vouchers for the weekend, but after the weekend, I don't know, I have to call FEMA back. Hour by hour. I'll worry about eating, sleeping, and everything else. <laughs> meal by meal, one day at a time. Two weeks after Irma, Frostproof is still struggling. Well, all right, you take care. In Frostproof, I'm Carson Chambers, ABC Action News. Yeah, one day at a time for those folks. And FEMA workers, you know, they started going door to door in Pasco County today to help people sign up for aid. And if you need help with your FEMA application, just go to our website, abcactionnews.com. We have posted a lot of resources there for you, including ways to get your application processed faster and more efficiently and how to get free roof repairs.